Carrie Prejean on Larry King. Uh, she went on last night, and then she was just outraged by Larry King's question. W what's awesome is Larry King's total confusion as to why the question is, as she says, inappropriate. This is just classic Larry King, man. So let's watch as she pretends to leave and then does it. Carrie Prejean, she is the author of Still Stabbing. That book is available everywhere. We'll take a call or two for Carrie in a moment. You sued the, the pageant after they fired you, they countersued, and then you accused them of a number of things, including religious discrimination. Clearly an issue very important to you. Why did you settle? You don't have to tell me the terms of the settlement, but you know why what, settle Larry? since you had a fight to carry on? Larry, everything that was discussed in mediation, I'll say it again, is completely confidential. I'm not, I'm not going to be able to talk about that, so I'm just letting you know that ahead of time. So you, you, you can't even say why you settled? That's not, well, how does that break what you settled for? I'm not asking you what the settlement was. I'm asking you, agreement. why did you agree to it's, settle? It's a confidential agreement, and I am not allowed to talk about that. So the agreement discusses the motive behind why each party agreed? Larry, you're being inappropriate. Oh, that's awesome. You really are. So I'm what? not going to talk about... I'm asking a question. I'm not, not going to talk about anything that was discussed in, in mediation. It's completely confidential, and it was a confidential settlement. All I'm asking... So, all right, so what you're saying is, in mediation, it was discussed why you were mediating. Larry, it's completely it confidential, and you're being inappropriate. Okay. Okay? So All right. Being, you're inappropriate being King Live continues. <laughs> yes. Detroit, hello. Hi, I'm calling from Detroit. Yes. Um, I'm a gay man, and I love pageants. Um, I'm sure that you, Carrie, have got, you know, great gay friends that helped you. There she possibly goes. Win. What would you give them as advice if they wanted to get married? Did you hear the question, Carrie? Here comes awkward television, which I love. Did she hear the question? Is she leaving? Because I asked what motivated the settlement. Excuse me? <laughs> Did you hear the question? No, I can't hear you. You took the mic off. and you put the mic on, we can hear you. Yeah, I think that you are being extremely inappropriate right now, and I'm about to leave your show. So then do it. Well, so I went to another area. I took a phone call. They asked a question of you. I left that subject. You feel it was inappropriate? I didn't mean to be inappropriate. I just thought it was a logical question. But you need to have a mic. <laughs> Who are you talking to? <laughs> okay, I love this. I can't get enough. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> we'll be back right after these messages on Larry King Live. <laughs> I don't know which part of that I loved more. What? Hello? Are you there? What's going on? I asked an inappropriate question. <laughs> what was great is how shocked Larry King was. He's like, listen, little lady, I haven't asked a tough question in decades. I don't even know what I'm asking. I just asked you what happened in the settlement, and you freaked the hell out, man. Like, I don't think Larry King understands why she thought that was an inappropriate question. Because, you know, here's the backstory behind it. What happened in those negotiations is they came in to the Miss California people, which they were going to sue, Carrie Prejean and her mom. They're like, I'll tell you what, you're going to give us a lot of money for all you did, la, la, la. And the uh, Miss California people were like, oh, really? Hmm. Why don't we watch this tape first and see what happens? And they put in a tape of Carrie Prejean going to work on herself. Okay, boop, 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 boop. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> so now later she, um, on Hannity's program, said that was not a sex tape. It was just of her masturbating. Okay, whatever you like, right? So, but I don't think Larry King knows any of that, right? <laughs> He's just asking what happened in the mediation. He's like, and then she's like, that's inappropriate. He's like, what? <laughs> Why would that be inappropriate? <laughs> oh, that was so much fun. And then I'll tell you what. Because I'm a very bad, bad man. Every time she said, you're being inappropriate, I was a little turned on. <laughs> I tell you what, you got to give her credit for this. She is hot, man. And the way she's like, you're very, very inappropriate. I thought, I am, aren't I? <laughs> and who, by the way, who is she talking to? Of course, her publicist. And she's already a diva.
She's on top of the world. She can't be bothered by Larry King and his inappropriate questions. She'll walk up. Except she didn't, because she's like, mmm, TV, camera, must make love to it. Right? She couldn't. She wants to leave, but she can't. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> she's drawn back in.